Hello everyone, this is Sarfraz from Aristotle Prep and we are looking at question 90 from the OG13 RC chapter. In case you haven't understood this passage properly, please watch the video for question 87 in which I discuss the passage in great detail. So the question says the author implies that, implies means it's an inference question, which means you must avoid extreme option. So the author implies that Duverger's actual findings are so, well, I'm guessing it will be like a midway somewhere. So, are good and bad both? I mean, they have their positive uh, um, uh, points and they also have some negative points. Uh, or I could be wrong, but that's what I have in mind. So, uh, do Verger's findings are limited because they focus only on four countries? No. Uh, B says they are inaccurate in their description of the four countries. Absolutely not. C says um, they are out of date that they are inapplicable in the four countries today. That actually I recall reading in the passage uh, that the context has changed so the approach is uh, more reliable than the findings. C could be the answer. D says findings are flawed because they are based on unsound data is too extreme. Uh, findings are biased nowhere in the passage. C is the answer uh, and it's coming from that part that I mentioned. Uh, I'll tell you the line number I'll go back and check. Uh, line number 19 and 20. Duverge's approach has proved more durable than his findings. So, because findings have become uh, out of date now. So, C is the, the answer to your uh, question.